being so business savvy, do you mm. think that like when it comes to the music and getting yeah. these deals, yeah. do you think that was a plus or a negative? And, and I, I ask this question because yeah. sometimes I feel like the more I know, because I know certain I ain't really going for everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that don't but now in return I'm not in every room that I want to be in. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm not I'm not getting the looks that I want to get yeah, cuz yeah, I know yeah, better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You think it hurts you sometimes? Yeah, I think that hurt I think that shit hurt me a lot, you know what I'm saying? Just being like sometimes you could be too smart for yeah. a lot of people, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Like a lot of these people don't don't want to deal with artists who like they feel like know too much. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Cuz like damn, like how I'm going to Get over. <laughs> yeah, how I'm gonna get over, like, give you the short end of the stick if you know too much. Like, I'd rather go deal with somebody, you know what I'm saying, that I that don't really know too much. And a lot of times, those people that don't really know too much do get bigger opportunities, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying, because they, you know what I'm saying, so. Because they kinda, take the opportunity over the money, kind of. Yeah, they take the opportunity over the money, but a lot of them end up up in the end, though. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? It, it feel good during that time where, like, the opportunity coming, 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 but, like, at what about the end game? Like at the end of the day, like when all that got them get the decline is like now it come down to what deal did you negotiate? You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? What what did you get out the deal? You know what I'm saying? If you ain't get nothing out the deal, cause you just living in that moment, that fast moment, of like having everything you ever wanted. You know what I'm saying? It was like, you know, it, you just gotta like just weigh it. Like some people like want the, you know the right now some people like think about the long term and i feel like the way i'm pacing my career like i'm 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 finna get ready to get to the point where like i'm um i'm gonna be able to do all this stuff they could do for me like by myself you know mm -hmm. what i'm saying so that's kind of what i'm trying to get so at the same time on the front end of my career like i made all the right moves on it and then from that shit, i got damn made the right moves to uh Put myself in a position to be in the same rooms as like the opportunities they get because I'm moving off money. I don't give a what what it is, what type of relationship. No you got cap. the money to do it, it can happen. Money made the world go around for real. Yeah, I think so. yo. So question. Do you, so let's go back though, right? Mm -hmm. Young blue coming up. Yeah. Right, like you hungry for it. Yeah. Looking at it now, right? Yeah, you successful and you can take care of your family. You're in a, you're in a better position than a lot of people who who do get the look, right? Mm -hmm. I feel like we, we can say that. Does it ever be a time where like you want to get the the notoriety, right? Like it's do it does it ever be mm -hmm. a time where I could like man, I wish I could like trade off some, like not have yeah. as much money, yeah. right? Yeah. But have more exposure where niggas can really like know who the f I am for real. Um, I mean, I f no, I feel like it's just it's just a chance every artist got to take. You know what I'm saying? It's just a chance every artist got to take. Like maybe I will take it one day. Like you know what I'm saying? If it's the right situation, I'm never gonna get like. I'm never gonna let nobody me, you know what I'm saying? But if it's the right situation, mm. I don't know. It just depends on what you want out your career. Like, mm. It just depends on what you Wait, want. Wait, what you want? What you want? I just, I just want to, I want to be good. Like I want to be good and just looked at as like an artist who's smart, talented, and and you know, respected. You feel me? Like mm. I don't really care too much about like being like just. uh mega famous or uh, like that or everybody just you know i feel like that's i feel like that's too much to keep up with like because you always got to be like when you that up i feel like it's always room for like people to say you you know what i'm saying going down because you just held on such a pedestal i feel like being like underrated kind of like a good move ain't nobody's like like they just go back to the first week yeah, I sold what twenty. I sold like twenty k first week on my last project. I ain't sell a hundred k, but nobody talked about that. Nobody talked mm -hmm. about it like as a failure because okay, because don't expect nothing. Don't don't expect don't expect me like you know what I'm saying to 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 do that. You yeah. just expect me to have hit records when they hear it. You feel me? Like and just be blue. You feel me? Like a lot of these got a lot of pressure. Mm. on them because people just expect so much from them and I don't really like that shit. 
But wait, like wait, 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 wait. Hold up, hold up, yeah. hold up. We ain't about to, let's not, let, let's not just, just fast forward through this. Yeah. Is that something you just, is this a place where you just got to? Or, because like, it, it had to be a place back in the day where you wanted to be the, 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 the most lit or the most famous, no? Or you just always been like that? I feel like before I knew the industry, you know what I'm saying? Before I knew mm. I did all this, is make believe, for real. That's you know what I'm saying? So talk, for right. real. Yeah. So, so once you found out it was like BS, it was like, man, I just want to make my money and just ducked off, be ducked off for real. Yeah, because like I mean, realistically, like man, a hit record, and a hit record, and like being the most talked about is all in marketing. Mm. Like it's marketing. Whoever's spending the most marketing, like whoever's spending the most marketing bag at that moment, gonna be the most talked about. Like when it's a new artist on the scene, guess what? The labels go open up the marketing budget and go make this person the most talked about person. You feel me? And you will understand. Once you're not seeing them talked about as much, it's not because like they're not popping. It's just because they stop spending the marketing. You know mm. what I'm saying? So why well, base your career off that? You know what I'm saying? Base your career. I base my career off music. You know what I'm saying? Mm. I base my I base my career off that. Soon enough, all the other shit that catch up to it. You feel me? Like I rather retire, slept on with forty platinum plaques. You know what I'm saying? Double platinum plaques and a core fan base that I can go out on tour and they'll come see me whenever I want to and pay it up. Then, goddamn, a uh, 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 fallen star. You feel me? It, it's up. It's crazy. Because I'm about to make an analogy, right? And I like, kill me for it. But I yeah. swear to God, I was looking, I was listening yeah. to your interviews and I'm like, yo, this, and the, yeah. this remind me of an artist. I'm going to say that name. Yeah. But what you just said made me, made me think of him so much more. Yeah. Yeah. You remind me of French Montana when yeah. you say that. Yeah. Cause French Montana got some. Yeah. He probably got some. He could probably got more hits than a lot of yeah. n- think. Yeah. Like way more hits than n- favorite artists. Yeah, yeah. And he probably kicked up, and n- really don't talk about him like that. Yeah. And then when we do see his name, he's trying to throw mad shade yeah, and like yeah, that. Like, yeah, yeah. but he got hit after hit after hit after yeah. hit. Yeah. Nah, for sure. That like, but I feel like that's. I don't know. It's just like I said. It just depends on what you want. You know what I'm saying? It just depends on what you want. If you want the startup, now there's some people that could do that. They could do both. I feel like I'm a person that could do both, but I feel like it ain't that time yet. I feel mm-hmm. like it ain't that time yet. Like I gotta make sure my front end straight before I'm at the point now. I feel like I done started enough businesses. I done made enough money. You know what I'm saying? To where like my next deal situation? Cause I'm on my last. Uh, I'm on my last album with. Uh, Empire, uh, so I'm finna be like, you know, super independent, but you know, I'm probably thinking about going to like a major this time and and you know, thinking about it, but uh, yeah, I might do something like that because I'm good, I'm good now, like, I ain't I ain't losing nothing, so the the everything balanced now, you man. Know? It's so many places to go, hold up, it's so many places. All right, so hold up, <laughs> before we go into the business of the music. I want to yeah. talk about that. Yeah. It's not if we had to look back, because I like going back, you feel me? So like yeah. or you or even now, you don't feel like you slept on or you just don't care. Or and and if you ever did yeah. feel like that, like where did that go? Like talk to me about that. Like, even if you grew past it. Yeah. Tell me about that no feelings. Oh uh, I mean, I do feel like I'm slept on, but I understand like why I'm not slept on. I mean, I'm I understand why I'm slept on though, so it really don't make me mad. For real, it, or is that just right now? No. Tell me about the moments when it do when it do get to you, or no, it bro, don't ever get like, to you. Like you gotta look at it, bro. Like I know what make me slept on. It's because I really don't do the most. You feel me? That's mm. the only reason I'm like, bro. Like when I be in my little mood, I just be hella talkative and just I'm on blogs every day. Like I'm, mm. I, you know what I'm saying? Like people like controversy these days. Like fact, if yeah. you could be one of those people that just like love controversy or. Love keeping your name and some, shit. and I I mean I could I could say some, shit. and if I just really wanted to like stir up the internet, I can go on a rant, get the distance, and fuck you fuck you or get the talking about my experiences with girls and mm-hmm. all this, shit and just be going viral every day. If I mm-hmm. really wanted to, it's in my power to do. You feel me? And just say all type of juicy shit that just make the blogs. And just want to and then you got me. a lot of stories you can go. It's, it's, you had a lot of experiences you can go in. If yeah, you want to. like if I really just wanted to, but it's just like 
is that me though. That's not. That's never been me. So and I never been really been comfortable being in that light. So sometimes I just be like, these days you gotta be that to you gotta be comfortable being in that type of light, being judged all the time to be like viral. You feel oh, me? Wait, right there, right there. Hold up. So thinking about that outside of the industry, right? Yeah. Does that ever make you frustrated? Like, man, I like this is really the world. Like that is the world. It's the it's it's, it's a shame yeah. sometimes. I think like. That it don't make me frustrated, bro. It don't make me yeah. frustrated because I, cause, cause it's, 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 I'm past it now. Like I, I you didn't get too much money. That's why. Yeah, nah. Like, <laughs> ain't, 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 I just like too much money, nigga. nah. It's just like shit. It's like that's not really what I want. Like I want to blow up and if I don't, if I don't get there my way, then if I do get there, I'm gonna feel like it. What it ain't me, and I ain't gonna mm. feel good about it. So it's like shit. Why? If I'm feeling good right, if I'm feeling good right now, why would I? Why would I change? Like, mm. why would I change? Like, don't. And then at this point, for real, I don't feel like I feel like me changing up right now. After I've been this way my whole career, I feel like that's corny. Nah, Pe- people sure. look at and people look at me corny. Like if I automatically just start doing that yeah. out of nowhere You're and I never them. was like that, yeah. I feel like it'll be corny and it won't work. Like for somebody else that's been doing that from the get go. You facts. know what I'm saying? Like nah, it'll just be looked at. Like, Blue bear corny, you know what I'm saying? Nah, facts. You right. So I, I rather before I do that, I just let the music speak for itself. Like you know what I'm saying? If I wanna, like I'm rid of the type where I could put out a hit when I want to. Like I don't really. Every time I don't got a hit out, like it's because I'm doing some business shit that I'm just focused on. Like right now, like last year, I really just been like building my building my facility. Like I've been on, you know, I'm getting a lot of acting roles. Just started a production company, like all that shit, like that. Take like time, bro. That shit take like months, and months. You'll look up three months past, four months past, five months past. Yeah, to the fans, they like, oh, what, 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 blue it was like shit. To me, it's like shit going by fast as fuck. Like I'm in a whole nother, you know. I don't want to be held to just doing this one thing that y'all think I'm supposed to be doing when I got so many other dreams mm-hmm. that if I don't start on right now, they not gonna be in full fruition by the time, you know what I'm saying? You so I dab, I did been dabbling, I did been dabbling everything. Like, but is that taking away from the, the music? Cause you know, we, we, we want to hear the music. You just dropped the tape. Um, I ain't want, what's, what's Love Scars, Love Scars. Love Scars, right? Yeah. You just dropped that, but mm. you clearly was doing business shit. You was doing other things, right? Yeah. Do you think that get in the way of the music and do you think the fans can hear that, right? Like it's- nah. I don't feel like it do, cause like I swear I, bro, I ain't getting not one bad review on this album. You know what I'm saying? Like I ain't getting not one bad review on this album. People love the album. Like I said, like the only reason that they make this album as big as the other one because I ain't have no big. singles that I was pushing off there before. Like, you know what I'm saying? That I was just going crazy behind. Like I said, cause I was doing some other shit. I really just dropped that for my core fan base. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? It wasn't like one of those commercially promoted albums like that. Um, like, but when I get in that bag, like I could do that when I want to. If I go in there and I, you know, looking to make a single, you know what I'm saying? That's gonna be play here and play here. Like I could do that when I want to. Like when I got like, you know, I got like a lot of accolades and shit that I'm I'm cool. Like I I never put myself in that category. I don't have the pressure that they have because like a lot of these artists have because I'm proven, bro. Like mm-hmm. whether it's on the underground scene, like don't nobody look at me as no. One hit wonder, you right, know what I'm nah, saying? You, you can't know. really say that. Yeah, you like you can't say that at all, honestly. Nah, you can't say that because I, I, I didn't had like a lot of records, like a lot of records. You know what I'm saying? Whether it's records you heard or not, whether really records you didn't heard about, like I've had a core for a long time, so I ain't got that pressure like that other people got. Like, well, I gotta make it. Another. I'm like, I'm cool. People know I'm a talented artist, all around artist. Like, mm. it ain't that pressure, you feel me? Nah, when I have a record, I got a record. <laughs> if I don't, like, I'm still blue. You know and what and, and, and it, it helps that, like like you said, you've been around for a while, yeah. so you was able to build up your uh, your audience and shit like that. Then you had yeah. big hits. We'll get to that all, also with the Drake's, but you then had, yeah. you had other hits as well before that, right? And yeah. the fact that you're independent, yeah. you are kind of like reaping everything, reaping the benefit of all your own work, right? Like, yeah. you don't gotta, you, don't, you ain't getting, going to nobody else. You're getting all your money on, on, the, on the top, yeah. bro. Man, so I mean, it ain't none of that. Like, I, mean, I, don't, I don't look at shit like that. Let me ask you this then, yeah. cause I uh, I be talk I was talking to a, I talking to a lot of artists coming up, right? Yeah. So many artists in the world, right? Yeah. 
and uh, it's, a, it's so, but it's more artists in the world that we don't know than we actually do. Yeah, no. right. I was wondering, just with all your businesses, right? Yeah. Um, if moving forward, mm-hmm. if it had to be, you just be the richest person ever, right? You could take care of your family. Yeah. But you never had a hit going forward. Would you be okay with that? And the, you just got the bag. I mean, all the reason that question, what make that question hard is because like. If you got the money, you got the hit. Mm. That's the only, like. If you got the money, you got the hit, bro. Like, bro, look, you go make the wackiest song that you ever didn't make. I mean, we if you got a million dollars song, to put behind it, bro, that shit gonna go. Like, if you got a million dollars to put behind it, and you making sure motherfuckers hear that bitch everywhere, like, the, how the game is now, it's gonna go. Mm. I ain't saying that it's just gonna be like. The wacky, wacky song, but like it's everybody, a lot of wack everybody songs got a, right now. That's what I'm saying. It, so I'm just saying. It's a lot of, you know, I said you don't got to say it. It's a lot feel, of wack like songs. Like I'm saying, bro, if you got the motherfucking budget to have everybody on TikTok, all the influencers on TikTok doing the dances to this weak ass song, <laughs> and you if you got that budget, then it's gonna be what it's gonna be. It ain't got no choice because motherfuckers hear it all the time. So that's what I'm saying. A hit is these days, bro. I mean, it's some good records, you know what I'm saying, that make it easier. Like, okay, you got to look at this. It's like this. You probably drop a whack record that may take you a million dollars to make it a hit. Mm-hmm. But it's, you still can make it a hit with money, though. Mm-hmm. But I probably got a good-ass record that probably only took me $200,000 to make mm-hmm. a hit. That's the only difference. But both of them, if you spend enough, both of them can become grow. hits. You know I ain't going to lie to you. I'm going to keep it 100, though. I think it's the opposite. Your, your analogy, I think it's the opposite now. And me personally. Yeah. Because I'm coming up. You had, you got a lot of success. So yeah. you good. You feel good. You got your money. Me, yeah. I'm still striving for it. So yeah. me and make me mad. I'm going to yeah. be honest with you. Yeah. I'm going to keep it 100 with you. It's like the whack shit yeah. take less of the effort than the good shit. And me personally, I feel some type of way about that. I be like, yo, it's so many. I see so much talent out here. And it's like, damn, it's so unfortunate because, like, you see so many good artists, just, like, really good, and they not as popular as the people that's making some bullshit. Yeah. And I ain't gonna, I'll be like, Because damn. the people that's making the bullshit, they are spending more money. Mm. Well, it's just reason, catchy, too, though. I mean. It's catchy. Yeah. A lot of the bullshit be catchy. Like, it's be like, all right. But, but you gotta look talent. at You gotta look at this. All right. I'm gonna get it to you from, you looking at it from a spectator's fan for I'm gonna look at you. I'm gonna look at this from a uh, business standpoint. If I could come sign you for five bucks, I'm going to spend whatever to make whatever you drop popular, right? Mm-hmm. But if I got this other artist over here that make good music, got a core fan base, and they say, oh, man, I want a million yeah. to sign over there. Ain't nobody. Smart. They smart, they savvy, mm-hmm. they ain't like, they know they shit intellectual. They like, nah, well, I've been making this and this, well, I want this. You know right. what I'm saying? Yeah. You may sign them, but you already in a million. Yeah. So is you going to put another million? Facts. It's going to be hard for you to put another million. You like, oh, if that shit go, it go. If it's not, you know, if it don't, then it ain't going to go. Facts. If you if I sign you for $5, I got a million to go put behind marketing of that shit. Yeah. So I'm going to make it go. You Facts. feel me? So that's the difference. Like the artists that's like really good songwriters and artists that make a good good music, they kind of know they worth. Mm. So like it go back to what you were saying. It kind of like too smart for the system. Yeah. Like you know what I'm saying. So it's like it take us longer than the people who like they just go find a kid from the hood. Ain't never seen nothing. They never had nothing. You know, making a little rah rah song. Man, go on, come over here, man. I'm gonna give you this. Da 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 da. All right, fuck it. I just want to be famous. Right. Bam, get to them. Bam, they blow up. A lot of times, more than eight times out of ten, that be their last yeah. shit. One and done. You feel yeah, me? Yeah, so that was the labels. They go, oh, he hot. Bam, go spend a million. Bam, blow that up. Bam, make all the shit diamond now. Make that money. Bam, oh, on to the next. Who the next little popping kid? You know what I'm saying? Why would I go spend all this money on this good songwriter, intellectual, fucking know the business, he know all this shit? Why would I go spend all this money on him? If I could go get the five dollar kid and That's blow right. him up. And Yo, put not the to turn in. this into like a business podcast, bro. But I'm just, I, no. like I said, bro. I'm just like just watching you. I just had so much questions about the business because I'm yeah. not an artist, but I was curious because yeah. you were so open with a lot of the business part. But I feel like yeah. niggas weren't asking the questions that I had. A, I was curious about. Yeah. 
So question, if you can break it down now, since you're yeah. out of the deals. Yeah. You were saying at one point, like somebody was trying to give you uh, 300000 uh-huh. for for like eight projects, like three projects, and then somebody gave it gave you that same 300 for one project. Oh, yeah, Something yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. How does that work? Like, if let's say the, the, the label give you 300000 for three projects. Am I, am I banking that? Does one, does all the sales come to me now? And I'm banking that you're going to sell more records that make me more money? Like, how does that work? I'm talking about for the person that's offering you the three albums? Yeah, the, the relationship period. If, I, if I'm saying, yo, I'm going to give you $300,000, you got to give me three three albums. Yeah. What am I banking on? Like, what? how do I get my money back? Is it from the album sales? Yeah, it's from, the, from the album sales. Like, they hoping that you have a big single on one of those albums. Or they hoping that, yeah, they could just recoup that 300000 they they'll give you. And they hope they can recoup that off of one song, and the rest, and the rest of it be just pure profit. So that's where it would go wrong for an artist not betting on themselves. I would assume because if you give me three hundred, right, and I say yeah, and then my project hit, yeah, I probably could have made three hundred million. Not saying I would have, but if yeah. I would have, now I'm hurting like fuck. Like, but it's all a gamble though. Because what if you didn't make it? You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? What if you ain't make it? I mean, if you, it just depends on what situation you're in. Now, if you already seeing that. You know, it's about just if you know the business or not. If you already seeing that, then you obviously they gonna have to give you more. Right. But if you just put your music out, and you don't know where it's coming from. You just like oh three hundred thousand, shit. You don't really, you don't really know. Maybe right. it's cool for you to take the deal. Your first deal not always gonna be your best deal. Like I ain't had a best deal coming in. You know what I'm saying? I ain't had a best deal coming in. Like I, I negotiated. What was your first deal? What was your first deal? Uh, my first deal was with uh, with my first deal with Boosted Label. How much you give you? Well, I, I mean, get, I ain't getting, I ain't getting none. It's just I ain't, publicity type yeah. shit. Yeah, like I ain't. Wait, how old was you, you, was you then, though? I mean, cause that matters, right? That matters. Yeah, I, was I probably young. was like, I probably was like eighteen. I think I was like eighteen. Yeah. And Boosie, you probably looked up the Boosie at that time, maybe? Hell yeah. Every, yeah. I know I that did. That was my favorite I, artist. I was like, hell yeah, shit, I'm signing the Boosie. I was like, hell yeah, I'm signing It's open? Oh, I was about to say, um, so yeah. like, so like, yeah, that's crazy, because like, I would think, outside of that then, yeah. right, yeah. your first real deal, because I guess that's like, that's still- Yeah, so when I signed with Boosie, we signed a joint venture with Columbia, like, mm-hmm. six months, uh, six months later, and um, I mean, I think I got, I think I signed, and I'm like- like one fifty, I end up getting like fifty thousand of that. Wait, how? What the fuck? Cause I had like I was who we signed a joint venture. Okay, so, so it got to go to the, the yeah, yeah, first, yeah yeah yeah. You got to go the to the niggas that sign you, and then yeah. yeah for sure. Damn. So alright, so fifty to is it like three or like percentages? Like how does that like? I'm trying to know the numbers. Uh, I'm I'm, I'm what, looking the percentages? at percentages. Yeah. So how you get how you end up getting fifty? Shit, I don't know. I think probably like uh, Boosie and Boosie brothers split it. Oh, okay, they, they so split it's three the ways. other hundred. Oh, okay. yeah, it was, they split because Boosie brother brought me into a badass. Like he the one that found me and brought me to badass. Okay, you know what I'm saying. And then, you know, Boosie was kind of just you know the 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 face of it. But I was signed to. I really was signed to uh, through TQ. Okay. Yeah. Yo, how was that, bro? Think about like looking up like just again. We 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 both share yeah, that. Yeah. Like Boosie was like. He still yeah. is like the godfather of my city. Yeah. I'm from Boston. Like he, yeah, you feel yeah, me? Yeah. But coming from being a fan yeah. to walking into the business, yeah. How was that experience for you? Like, how was it? I mean, I mean, like I said, like once you get older and start like seeing certain things, like you know, a lot of time business can't fuck up a lot of shit. Like that's, you know what I'm saying? True. You know, but like I said, I always tried to, I always tried to uh, just. You know, keep the best relationship I I can, but you know, so a lot of times, you know, business, uh, you know, get in the way of that sometimes. Yeah, it get in the, it get in the way of that sometimes. So it's it's crazy because yeah. um I was talking to uh somebody and she was saying like sometimes when you get in these positions, like she know better that she don't even want to meet some of her uh like idols. Yeah, Cause yeah. Cause you know how it can it yeah, can, it, yeah. could, it could kind of like yeah. Yeah, but yeah. damage the relationship because now it's like I don't even look at you to say that. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, that, that, nah, that, that, that be, a, that be it a lot of times. But, uh, you know, like I said, I just, you know, I just, I just maneuver the way, the, the way I maneuver. Mm. You know, everything play out how it's supposed to play out. 